So over here, you can see that I have a bunch of objects in Google Data Studio right here. And if I want to revert back to an older version, then I can easily do so by using something called version history. So to access our version history, you can go around onto file right here. And then here you can see version history as an option. So right now you can go around over here and go to see version history. And then what happens is that you get different versions of the file right here. Let's say, for example, if I were to click this, then you can see that this is what you have. You get to an older version right here. You can go around and click over here. Then you get an older version right here. So depending on the date, you can see that you can go around onto a certain version of the file right here. So what you can do is you can click on restore the particular version right here and then the particular version will be restored. And another thing that you can do is you can go around over here, click on the three dot button over here as well and delete out a particular version if you don't want. So if you want to rename out a particular version, you can do that over here as well. You can rename out particular versions right here as you can see. And then another thing that you can do is you can go around and then turn on this filter right here so that you can just see the renamed out um, 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 uh, renamed out versions just like this. So that is how you can use the version history. So let's say, for example, if I want to, uh, let, let's say, restore out to this particular version, you can simply click on restore this version and click on restore. And then the uh, main file will be replaced out with this version right here. But the old versions are still safe. So if you want to uh, revert back to them, you can go to version history again, and then you can uh, see current version histories right here. So you can go around and click a particular version and then you can restore to that particular version as well. If you uh, want to save a particular version of the file right here, you can go to file as well and then go to version history and name the current version. So you can go around and rename it to however you want just like this. So that is how you can work around with version history inside of Google Data Studio. So hope you guys learn something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.